This video in front of your hot face right now is brought to you by Squarespace. From websites and online stores to marketing tools and analytics, Squarespace is the all-in-one platform to build a beautiful online presence and run your business. There's this tiny super DIY skate park here in New York City that Nike and the team here in New York City built. Now today might be the first time ever I heed a friend's warning and he said, don't go here alone, just wait for me. But if you do, and if you have to go, go really early in the morning. So it's 7.30 in the morning and I'm at least gonna go look at the skate park and I probably will try my best not to be too tempted to skate it because there's another spot anyways right up the street that I've always wanted to skate and that's way cooler. So here it is. Okay, this is a big fence. Now the spot is right behind the fence. I have no idea how to get in there so I'm gonna circle around and hope for the best, but I see the park. I'm not gonna lie, this skate park is sick as hell. We've had a lot of DIY skate parks back in my day and this one is far superior. The obstacles are way crazier. And I think it was strictly built by the locals who skate, not by any construction worker who came in to help. So this is a phenomenal job. This is amazing. I especially find this thing hilarious. <laughs> But seriously, the ledges look perfect. The concrete job up to the ramps looks so smooth. The flat rails, just the innovative obstacles in general. It looks like a really fun place to skate that I might not actually skate because I need to heed John's warning for once. I couldn't resist. I just wanted to do a few warm up tricks just to show off what it's like to skate on the obstacles. Plus, it's early. And also, there was a cop outside just posted up like six feet away from me. So I didn't feel like I was in that much danger. But this is the spot I wanted to actually skate. The spot itself was so cool, but the area felt way sketchy. As soon as I pulled up, there was something going on around me. There was a dude on the phone, and he's like, yo, yeah, I'm looking for him, man. He's got a red shirt. And I was like, I have a red shirt? So I didn't know what was happening, so I dipped out. So in any case, I do want to look at two more spots here in Brooklyn. One, that there's always a car in front of, and I'm just crossing my fingers to hope that we can skate it finally today. Luck is not on our side today. The other two spots didn't work out, and this one has a security guard that it looks like he's sleeping, I would assume. And I know right up the street there's this angle iron ledge, but I just noticed something else. That is another stroke of great luck. I forgot all my wax. So I don't know if I can get this spot to work. this amazing spot, I wanted to briefly talk about Squarespace. Designed for any purpose, Squarespace supports any type of major content, including pages, galleries, blogs, commerce, and calendars, and more. Two ands. Something I can't wait to utilize is online scheduling and booking, especially with meetings in the future. If I have availability, I'll just send over my calendar and somebody can check when my available times are and we can meet up and do our dang thing. But usually I'm making videos and having fun skateboarding, so. It's easy to set up contributors, have other people access your website if you're building it with partners. And they have an amazing commenting feature. Yes, people can reply and comment and like your posts on your website. So now your own Squarespace website can pretty much be your own social media outlet. Right now I use Squarespace for online stores, but I can't wait to utilize every single feature that I can possibly find and build an entire community through my own website. Check out the link in the... Go to squarespace.com slash John Hill. Oh my... Go to squarespace.com slash John Hill if you want 10% off your first sign up or domain. Check it out right now or just click the link in the description down below. Let's get this vibe.
Finally, we had time to skate somewhere. This ground is so smooth. These benches are awesome, but they're pretty tall. The flat rails are the most surprising thing of all because they feel pretty normal, like a normal flat rail, even though you feel like you couldn't do anything on it. Super fun spot. It's insane how many skate parks Nike is involved with in building or funding or something like that. But DIY skate parks are some of my favorites and I really do wish I had a constant DIY park to skate every day. There's just something about homemade type obstacles that I really vibe with, especially because it's just nostalgic. But I even had this thumbnail here about when you're too poor to go to Woodward. And I never showed that session, but that's a real session that actually happened. That's how much I love setting up my own ramps. is I've actually been to Woodward before. I went for four days with Nigel Alexander before I even really embarked on this whole YouTube channel thing. The ironic part is that I was like, one day I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna have kids be as excited to meet me as they were to meet Nigel. That day, so many kids were like, Nigel! And of course, nobody knew who I was. But the funny thing is, as an adult, I really didn't enjoy it as much as I was hoping to. I'm too used to what I did today. I'm too used to going around, skating, filming, and doing this whole mission, than being stuck at a skate park. Plus, I am a little older now, and I get exhausted if I'm there trying to skate for five days in a row. I can barely probably hang in for one full day. So no matter how amazing the city I live in is to skate, I still like tinkering around and building things like that and experimenting on anything I can find around the city. And on that note, I will see you guys next time for another video. Every Tuesday and Thursday, I upload at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Human beings, if you want, you can check out the Patreon to see all the B-sides of what I'm creating. But I will see you next time for another video. Human beings, I love you so much. Progress daily and keep killing it.